Hey, thank you for clicking this video. This is Rain Lassell and welcome to my channel. This channel is about perfume reviews, hauls, verses, and all that perfume jazz. So if you happen to like this video, please click like and do subscribe to my channel and comment down below if you what interests you in this perfume reviews and what are your thoughts. So today I'm going to review um, the one of the uh, perfume in my perfume haul episode last time. This is the Zadig and Voltaire. This is her, which I purchased by online. It's a nice bottle. It's a glass bottle, and um, yeah, this is a 30 ml eau de parfum. And for me, it's like a white floral thing in jasmine. And but according to um, other reviews, it is very uh, like sandalwoody fragrance. But anyway, um, bottle wise, um, it's it's nice. It's a white crystal uh, like crystal bottle, and the cap also is like a semi plastic semi metal thing with a logo. On the top of the cup, yeah. So, Zadig and Voltaire is an amber vanilla fragrance for women, which is also others uh, uh, pick up most of the sandalwood here. But um, this was launched in 2016, and um, the perfumery behind this is Sidoni, Lance and Michael of Mayrak. Yeah. I guess I can't pronounce the, the names probably, but uh, yeah, those two are the main um, responsible for the perfume. And the top notes are pink pepper, silkwood blossom, and jasmine sandbag. Um, mostly jasmine. Uh, the open notes that I can um, uh, send in this two perfumes, the jasmine sandbag really introduced itself to me. I mean, the first thing that I got in this perfume is the, is the sandbag jasmine it's a bomb jasmine like that and uh, middle notes will be whipped cream vanilla and chestnut uh, can I that's why in the middle of uh, and the heart notes of this one is like the sweetness after you you got the uh, the aroma of the sandbag jasmine it transformed into this very sweet but subtle uh, scent uh, maybe maybe because of the vanilla and uh, mixed with uh, whipped cream and the base note will be sandalwood and cashmere wood so uh, most that I can pick from here is the sandalwood with Mitch which makes it uh, woody it's like sweet woody notes if I may say or, and um, yeah it's a nice one but and it it has an elegant um, scent to it actually uh, I just got home from a party and I not a party club party but like a get-together uh, with my friends and I used this um, perfume because I when I was about to choose a fragrance I am telling myself that I want a fragrance that uh, not a little not a nor not too sweet but uh it's sweet but there's a little elegance to it i mean there's still an elegance to it so that's why i chose this one it's not that loud but there is it's a very sophisticated scent and elegance to it and sweet but floral so that's why i used this one during my get together with my friends a while ago and yeah and it's a nice scent of uh, longevity wise it's not that much but you can get maximum five hours for this one and if this one is blind by worthy it's i think it's half blind by worthy if you don't like sandbag like jasmine and if you don't like like too sweet perfumes don't buy this one it's a little too sweet and um yeah it, but if you happen if you will not like it but uh, if you will still decide to buy it, it's not it's not a bad decision as well because 
it's a good perfume it's a good one longevity sillage and protection so if you have planning to blind buy this one i still recommend it and uh, good luck <laughs> and that's it for me now thank you and uh, if you happen to have this perfume do share it in the comment below thank you and see you in my next video